On 22nd June 2018, a polio outbreak was declared in Papua New Guinea. A total of 26 cases have been reported, with the most recent in October 2018. PNG has one of the lowest routine immunization rates in the South Pacific region. Less than half of the children complete all their vaccinations by age one. Much of the population lives in remote, inaccessible areas, and people often don't have the means to travel to a health facility, nor do they know when their children should be vaccinated. It was because of this large unvaccinated population that polio re-emerged after nearly two decades. How did we respond? Following the outbreak, UNICEF, WHO and the government of PNG launched a vaccination campaign on an unprecedented scale, targeting 3.4 million children under the age of 15 with multiple vaccination rounds, ensuring every child in PNG got the life-saving vaccine. To achieve this, UNICEF mobilized over 20 international professionals, procured over 17 million doses of oral polio vaccines and cold chain equipment, engagement, advocacy and partnership building. Community and religious leaders, health workers and mobilizers announced campaigns and informed parents. Health workers traveled on foot through difficult terrain, by boat, helicopter and road to bring vaccines to the most remote parts of the country. Within one year, we've succeeded in bringing the virus to a halt. But there's an urgent need to strengthen routine immunization. UNICEF remains fully committed to ensuring that immunization services reach all children in Papua New Guinea. It actually is not just the right thing to do, but it's the smartest way of achieving a healthy economy, a healthy population and a much stronger society.